in today's video. It was a Saturday morning and my little baby girl Emma just woke up from her nap. Oh baby Emma, don't cry. Mommy's gonna be here soon. Did you have a bad dream? Or do you just want your mommy? Mama. Oh, you want your mommy. Well, she's coming. Hi, sweetheart. What's the matter? Did you wake up all cranky? Poor baby. I know something that's going to cheer you up. Here we go. Mommy's just going to buckle you in. <laughs> I knew you were going to like it. Hey, Mommy. Oh, hi, Maggie. Can I play with her? In a little bit, I got to feed her her bottle first. Okay, I'll wait. Okay, Emma, are you ready for your bottle? Wow, she's a hungry girl. She's eating that so fast. Oh, look at you. You're all finished. Good burping. Okay, Maggie, she's all done. Finally. All right, baby Emma, it's time to play. You know what's more exciting than just sitting here in this bouncy chair? A Tonka truck. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Goes the Tonka truck. Do you like it? I knew it. Maggie? Oh, crap. Why did you load Emma on the back of a Tonka truck? Because she likes it. Look at her. She's having fun. That's not safe, and she also looks really uncomfortable. Plus, she'll probably throw up from you driving her around in that car. She just ate. She looks to me like she's having fun. Aren't you, Emma? I want to be the one driving. We need to take turns. Okay, okay, I am all ready. Oh, you're taking up so much room. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, Mommy, we're ready. You're all ready? Good. Yep. Here we go. Hang on. Whee! Go faster, go faster. <laughs> oh, no, that's Emma crying. Sorry, guys, I'll be right back. Lame. Aw, it's okay, sweetheart. It's okay, come here. Did you have a bad dream? It's all right, don't worry. Oh. Hey, Mom. Is Emma okay? Yeah, she's fine. She was just a little upset when she woke up. Can I hold her? No, I want to hold her. No, no, I asked first. You are such a baby hogger. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. You hog them, and by the time they come back to me and I hold them, they're all out of snuggles. Hey, hey, hey. Guys, stop, stop. You both can hold them. Jenny will go first because she asked first, and then it's your turn. Ugh. Story of my life. Okay, Emma. You must be really hungry. It's time for your bottle. Uh Silly girl. Here you go. Here's her bottle. Thank you, Mom. Wow, you're such a fast drinker. Good job, Emma. Is she all done? Yep. Good. Don't forget to burp her or she might spit up. Like that. Ew! Ew, she spit up, Mom! Hang on, let me just get a wipe. It's okay, Emma, it's okay. Here, all done. Oh, she's all clean now. Yeah, just make sure to hold her upright so she doesn't spit up again, okay? Ew, she might spit up again? Oh. Oh, Derek! Derek! It's your turn! 
Finally, you get to hang out with me, your big brother. How do you feel about that, Emma? You really shouldn't suck your thumb. That can become a bad habit. Ow. Ow, or just do whatever you want. Oh, you think it's funny when you smack your big brother. Dude. Mom. Mom. Yeah? Please come get the baby. She filled her diapers. Okay, okay. Don't freak out. I'll get her. I'm not freaking out. I almost threw up in my mouth, though. Here you go, sweetheart. Let's change your diaper and let's change your outfit. Let's have a look. I'm pretty sure she made a number two. Oh yeah, she did. It's a big number two. Ew. Let's get her new diaper. So I cleaned her with some wipes and now we can throw this diaper finally out. And now I'm just going to put a new diaper on her. In case anyone is wondering, this diaper is a size newborn. And the clothes that she fits into are sometimes newborn size, or this one is a 0 to 3 months. I never did an unboxing video with Emma because I don't know, I just don't feel like I'm really good at unboxing videos. I rather introduce my dolls through like role play because that's what I'm most comfortable with. And this doll I actually got through Etsy from an actual reborn artist, so she is hand painted. And that's usually out of the ordinary for me. If you guys watch my videos, you'll see that most of the time I use the Amazon factory made reborn dolls. I still will use them in my videos, that's not going to change at all. Those are the ones that I really like to tell stories with. But I did save up my money to get this one. And I can see a big difference in the quality of this one and the ones of the silicone dolls that I usually get off Amazon. So it's really nice to add this one to the collection. I'm just showing you guys all the parts of her so you can see what she looks like. Um, but I'm gonna keep my Amazon dolls because I really love telling stories with them. One thing that I've noticed with this silicone doll compared to like, for instance, baby Noah that I bought on Amazon is that this one here is so much more floppier and the silicone of Noah seems to be more stiff. Like his head doesn't flop around automatically if you don't support it. So it's almost like a real baby. Let me just get the zipper. She looks so cute in this. I'm just quickly gonna fix her hair because it's really crazy right now. I haven't brushed her hair since I've gotten her. And let me show you the outfit. So this is a zero to three months and it's a little bit loose so she could probably go with a newborn. Anyways, don't go anywhere because we have one more video. It was a Saturday morning and my little baby nephew Louie was over. Oh, Louie, you're doing such a good job walking on the walker. Soon you're going to be able to walk all on your own and then you're going to be running. It's going to go by so fast. <coughs> you're doing so good. You keep practicing and your auntie's going to have a cup of coffee. <coughs> oh, hey, Louie. That's some nice walking you're doing there. You want to play some ball with me? It's gonna be fun. What do you think? <laughs> oh, sounds like you want to play ball. Okay, I'm gonna roll it to you, and then you're gonna roll it back. Derek? Remember, if you're gonna play in the house with a the ball, there's no kicking and no throwing, okay? I know, I know. I'll make sure that Louie listens. <laughs> That's good. You don't want any accidents to happen. Okay, Louie, you hurt your auntie. No kicking or throwing. Here we go. Okay, your turn to roll it back. Oh, that's a good one, Louie. Oh, you're really excited about playing ball. Hey, Louie, don't do that. Remember, my mom said no kicking or throwing. We just do a nice little gentle push. 
Louis, stop it. You're not listening. Hey, I said no kicking. Someone can get hurt here. I was telling him that, but he's not listening, Mom. Then you need to take away the ball from... I love it. Wow, Louis. That was a good kick. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> oh, I wish I could read. Oh, my stomach is growling. I'm hungry. What can I eat? Hmm. Oh, yeah. Good thing I remembered. I almost... Ow. Forgot. I swear I put it under the bed. Where could it be? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I love pizza so, so much. Mmm. Yummy. Oh, it's so delicious. Oh, hey. I didn't know we had pizza. Is that pepperoni? Can I have some? No, sorry. Ew, Maggie, you're disgusting. And why can't I have some of the pizza? How come no one else told me that we ordered? This is not your pizza, it's my pizza. I've been saving it under the bed for like five days. Remember, last Tuesday, Pizza Tuesday? This is the pizza. You've had this pizza under your bed for five days? That's right. Do you know how nasty that is? It's not nasty. It's not nasty at all. That pizza is gone bad, and you're gonna get sick from it, Maggie. No, I keep stuff under my bed all the time, and then I eat it a few days later. It's fine. You're supposed to keep pizza in the fridge. That is so bad for you. You know what? You're gonna throw up from it. That's disgusting. Ew. You're just jealous that I have pizza and you don't. What a bit. One hour later. What's going on in here? Is everything all right? Maggie, what's wrong? I feel sick. I feel sick. I feel sick. I feel so sick. Oh my goodness, I think we better take you to the doctor, Maggie. Huh, okay. Why on earth would you eat a five-day-old pizza from under your bed? Well, I kept it in a box. It wasn't dirty. How many bites did you take? Three. Three? Uh, three slices. Three slices? This is all your fault. Why did you have to tattletale? Because mom was wondering why you were throwing up like a volcano. You threw up on my homework and then you threw up on Derek's iPad. Someone's gonna clean that, right? Why are you here anyways? Because I find the doctor's office very interesting. And mom promised me ice cream if I come along. Well, us. Well, not you. Because you know, you're just gonna throw it all up anyway. Shut up! Don't tell him to shut up, you shut up. You wanna take this outside, huh? Crap. Good afternoon. Where is our little patient? Well, hi there, my name is Dr. Kerrigan. But you can just call me Dr. K. K, Dr. K, I'm Maggie and you can just call me Maggie. Oh, Maggie. I had no idea you were a clown. A what? I mean a comedian. Now open your mouth and we're gonna check what is wrong with you. So your mother told me that you have been throwing up non-stop like the Niagara Falls. Well, yeah, but I'm not sure why. Well, your mother told me that you had some bad pizza under your bed that you've eaten. It looked and smelled fine. The pepperoni was fine, the cheese was fine, and the peppers were fine. 
all those things, my dear, belong in the fridge and not to be stored under your bed. Now, dear, I'm just going to quickly check your temperature. I have a little suspicion that you might have a fever. Just hold still for a minute. Thank you, dear. Ah, just as I suspect, you have a fever. You know what I think you have? Food poisoning. Food poisoning? Yes, food poisoning. Food poisoning? Yes, Maggie, she said you have food poisoning. Can we get some ice cream finally? Wait, if I have food poisoning, what's gonna happen to me? Not much, dear. You're just gonna have to wait it out. Couple of days, two week. Don't forget to take something for your tummy, and especially do not eat any more expired pizza. Okay, doctor. Now you have a very good day, my dear. Don't forget to grab some candy on the way out. Oh my goodness. Okay, can we get some ice cream now? Hey everyone, did you guys like this video? Go check out these ones from our channel. Thanks so much for watching.